Bible verses about offense. The discretion of a man deferreth his anger, and it is his glory to pass over a transgression. Proverbs chapter 19, verse 11. Also take no heed unto all words that are spoken, lest thou hear thy servant curse thee. Ecclesiastes chapter 7, verses 21 to 22. A brother offended is harder to be won than a strong city, and their contentions are like the bars of a castle. Proverbs chapter 18, verse 19. Moreover, if thy brother shall trespass against thee, go and tell him his fault between thee and him alone. If he shall hear thee, thou hast gained thy brother. Matthew chapter 18, verses 15 to 17. For where envying and strife is, there is confusion and every evil work. James chapter 3, verse 16. Take heed to yourselves. If thy brother trespass against thee, rebuke him, and if he repent, forgive him. Luke chapter 17, verses 3 to 4. Thou shalt not avenge nor bear any grudge against the children of thy people but thou shalt love thy neighbor as thyself. I am the Lord. Leviticus chapter 19, verse 18. These six things that the Lord hate, yea, seven are an abomination unto him, a proud look, a lying tongue, and hands that shed innocent blood, a heart that deviseth wicked imaginations, feet that be swift in running to mischief, a false witness that speaketh lies, and he that soweth discord among brethren. Proverbs chapter 6, verses 16 to 19. With all lowliness and meekness, with long suffering, forbearing one another in love. Ephesians chapter 4, verses 2 to 3. Though I speak with the tongues of men and of angels, and have not charity, I am become as sounding brass or a tinkling symbol. 1 Corinthians chapter 13, verses 1 to 13. Who, when he was reviled, reviled not again. When he suffered, he threatened not, but committed himself to him that judges righteously. 1 Peter chapter 2, verse 23. Judge not that ye be not judged. Matthew chapter 7, verses 1 to 5. Open rebuke is better than secret love. Proverbs chapter 27, verses 5 to 6. Brethren, if a man be overtaken in a fault, ye which are spiritual, restore such a one in the spirit of meekness, considering thyself, lest thou also be tempted. Galatians chapter 6, verses 1 to 3. Wherefore, my beloved brethren, let every man be swift to hear, slow to speak, slow to wrath. James chapter 1, verse 19. And herein do I exercise myself, to have always a conscience void of offense toward God and toward men. Acts chapter 24, verse 16. Woe unto the world because of offenses, for it must needs be that offenses come, but woe to that man by whom the offense cometh. Matthew chapter 18, verse 7.